rainy day. Bum, bottom, bum, bum. So we made it to the Breloch Inn and I've forgotten one thing. It is fucking sexy as hell. And I like it. <laughs> oh, it's a double lock. Or I unlocked it the wrong way. Or it is double lock, yes. Wait, wait. Wait. Unless it's just the bottom lock, I don't know. Oh. Ah, there we go. Oy. Oh, God. Man. Boop. Low light, but hey, that's... Oh, <laughs> oh my God. This is fucking... This is nice. This is cute. I love it's it. Extremely nice. We should move here. <laughs> hey, look at this. Isn't this weird how this happened? A little dipshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, this is. <laughs> it is quite, I like it. It's just. Oh, I'm curious to see what else we got here. Let's see. A little closet space, that's cute. I like that. And. More closer space and a shielding. I like it. Sold. <laughs> they have coffee and beans. Mm. How fancy. <laughs> I'll definitely say just the first looks, just inside and such. I'll definitely take more pictures and stuff to show you, but the area of Casanova looks really nice. And the hotel itself is sheer excellent. Kind of makes me consider more and thinking apartments, how much? <laughs> but I like it, it looks awesome. So we found darts. Yeah, I haven't played darts in a while. So this... Hey, oh, that's not bad. That's six. not bad. Try going for the trip to it's really hard. Do you want to try? Oh, we've got to now. Here we go. And. <gasps> oh, what? That is... What? That's a 12. Aww. That's a 12. <laughs> that is all. Do you know what's excellent about this as well? We were just talking about it. It is so warm. They've not replaced this. It looks so cool and it's still in working this order. This is probably yeah. the one and only dartboard they purchased. Looking yeah. at the amount of patina on it. Like it's, it's filthy and fantastic. Also as well they got like the pianos here as well. Or peonies. And pool. This, and this is just the downstairs cellar area. We were talking with the lady upstairs. This used to be a cellar. This used to be a private home. Um, yep. Built in the 1800s. Mm -hmm. Owned by a single family since 1940-odd. And expanded upon over the course of the years. And it's quite nice as well where they turned around and they were basically like, Hey, on your check-in and stuff, would you like me to pour you a glass of sherry or scotch now? Or would you like to settle in and come get it? I'm like... Why can't all hotels do this? <laughs> but this has definitely got the coyness side of things. This is just a little... This is so cozy. Okay. This, they is, got... this is, you know what Oh this my is? god, they've got chess and checkers. Oh, lovely. This is... Oh. You know what this is? What's that? Kutch. It's a kutch. It's kutch. It's a kutch area. This is just kind of like a man cave. <laughs> man cave kutch. Yeah. Excellent. I mean, this is all just one area of it. There's a dining room, in which that'll be later tonight, but... Oh. So good. Hi. 
So, settling in, finishing off the Scotch and Sherry. I'm gonna stretch our legs and look around here. Definitely like this small campus near the facilities, but also as well, it's just. <sighs> I'd like to throw in my previous statement. Any places renting a good apartment? I would kind of like that, please. It's so. Hey, 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 hey. It is so quaint. I like this place. I'm going to check into the town just down here to see what it's like, but oh my god. Oh, I love it. Fuck it's, off. I know. Why are you telling me to fuck off? Fuck off. It's because of the tea lounge. It's because of the fucking tea lounge. And again, we've got to go to that place that has the rainbow flag. Fuck! Ah. Back from my little adventures in town, in which I will say, we need more time when the weather is not... Shit. Shit. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, the one place we stopped at was a small little tea house in which had so many good freaking teas for a decent price and they sold the merchandise there as well. And I'm going to pull this up. But we tried a special called, the f what was it, the Flight of Teas? Yeah, Flight of Teas. Three, three different teas for two. Like single price, just any three teas off the menu. Yeah. And... Uh, Tried about obviously Earl Grey, one that was a white needle tea, and then the last one, which I have to get up because it was a sweet tea as hell, called a matcha. And straight away it was just super sweet, and I'll tell you why. I got the reading right here. So, a matcha sweet tea from Japan. A tea not widely known outside Japan. A matcha, also known as Buddha's tea, as it is drunk on in Japan for Buddha's birthday on April 8th is made from feminated hydrania leaves after the initial very sweet impression said to be 200 times stronger than sugar the licorice notes take over and linger in the mouth for an unforgettable very refined tasting experience for me it was like a dessert tea very very sweet definitely didn't need sugar or anything it was just straight away but this one so, so yes, it started off with an absolute punch in the mouth sweetness, but then that licorice note that they were talking about mellowed it out. It didn't like suddenly taste like you licked a star anise. It, it was like sweet chill. Like it was, just, yeah. It was just really. It was. It's, it's legitimately undescribable. It was unlike any other tea I've had. So I immediately bought some. Pretty much. I bought some loose leaves and. And then. Oh god. I've never heard of it, never had it, never even no. knew it existed. And this place had it. And it's it's really good. It's remarkably good. And then looking around the town as well, there was one or two little things in which it was like, we'll have to come back. There's a fucking kitchen store. There is a kitchen store and they sell some good shit there and it's like we'll have to come back sometime in the weekend or the next paychecks or so just the coming area because it's 45 minute drive for us so that walk around the town and then back home yeah that's perfectly fine but also as well it's just half the stuff here one more time apartment rent us okay really good Bear in mind, we still got a bottle of wine upstairs in the bedroom. Guinness steak pie. And what have you got? Chicken roulade. That. This is big dishes. We're going to sleep well tonight. So, absolutely an excellent night. Food was exquisite. I had a box made up because it was so much and it's oh, so good. But, you know, I'm gonna call it a night. Because it is sleepy time, I am feeling sleepy. Are you the sleepers? Oh, yep. So, I'm gonna call it Thank you guys for watching today's little video and definitely this nice little stay here in the Bray Lock Inn. I think it's definitely worth looking if you're ever in the Casanova area in New York. Definitely look it up, it is fantastic. But I shall see you guys tomorrow for a brass bike in your day and hopefully it'll be better than the rest. But until then, take these guys. I'll stop.